welcome to the Perez Show. This is our first episode. I got my man B Shells. My name is V Perez. I'm gonna bring him out, let him introduce himself a little bit. He's gonna tell you where he's from. You gotta sit back and listen. What's going on, man? It's your homie B Shells out here, chilling with my homie VA at the Perez Show. Coming all the way from Detroit, he hit me up like, yo, slide through. I wanna interview you. So I'm like, cool, I'm with it. So, you know, we out here making good music, staying fresh all day. That's what we do. Anthem Culture, what's up? Hey, man, first question, B Shells, man, since you got this mixtape out, uh -huh. you know what I mean? Tell the people a little bit about the mixtape you got out already. Mixtape is called Fits, Fresh in the Suburbs, you know. If you listen to it, it's a real cool, real cool, real fresh kind of vibe to it. I mean, just kick back, put it on wear some fresh shit to it. That's what we do, so Vince is basically about my lifestyle, how I'm trying to live, how I want to live, everything around me. It's just cool and fresh cool. in the suburbs. Yeah. That's, that's the best part, you know, so uh -huh. being in the suburbs. You know? You know? Not a lot of people understand, like, not everyone came from, you know, the hood. Yeah, exactly. I ain't want to rich portray that. Suburbs right in the middle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You still you still got to worry about different things, but at the same uh -huh. time, keep the music fresh. Yeah. And that's a good thing, man. I see you out here. You know, I see you fresh with your new outfit. You know what I mean? <laughs> I see you out here shining. I'm out here trying a little you know bit. <laughs> but um, you actually produce your own tracks. Mm -hmm. You know, so like being a producer, seeing all these young rappers coming out like Big Crit, you know, he came, he's basically yep. producing his own his own stuff right yeah, out the gate. Hot. You know, Kanye got on Rockefeller for producing, uh -huh. and then he had to grind to get on as a rapper. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But you doing both already. Everyone knows you're doing both, and you're good at both. Yeah. Like, you know, is it any people you want to work with in the local area and outside? Yeah, as far as the local scene, I definitely want to work with people who have, like, a cohesive sound with me. I mean, I sample most of the time. So, like, I have my own turntable, MPC 2000 XL. For those producer heads out there, okay. that's what I rock with. So I mean, yeah, it's definitely a fun process producing my own music and then on top of that going over and rapping over it. So yeah, basically anybody with like a sample sound, chill sound, that's the kind of vibe I'm going for nowadays. So definitely work with anybody on that. What local artists do you want to work with? Definitely it's a couple out there that I've been in contact with. I mean, my homie Chris Metro, shout out to Chris, he just hit me up the other day actually on the text and was like, yo, Shells, we gotta work together soon, fall through, I got some ideas, so I'm like, cool. So definitely Chris, my homie Morris Jackson, I know you're familiar with him, he doing this thing out here too. So yeah, definitely, I mean, cool cats like that. Yeah. Good music, good people. So real quick, where you wanna, where you wanna take your music to? I wanna take my music to the mainstream level. Okay. So like, I'm doing this thing like as far as fits and whatnot. I'm keeping that whole sort of vibe to myself right now. Okay. So it's like staying fresh, so trying to mix music with fashion and everything. So okay. yeah, definitely do some collaborations of that. You trying to go on a fashion, you're trying to go rip the runway down yeah. <laughs> Streetwear, man. This is but not yeah. a plug. This is not a plug. <laughs> um, yeah, exactly though. I mean, but that'd be cool. That's I mean that's more exposure for you, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like Lupe Fiasco did it before yeah. you know he ripped the runway it was kind of weird <laughs> but uh you know what i'm saying you could do the same thing you know uh -huh. take it to another level yeah you know? but Definitely one thing trying I, to do that one thing i do want to touch on man you are a student yes you know? university you know? of pittsburgh what, what's your major majoring in business marketing this is actually really fun yeah <laughs> yeah actually that was my major too. <laughs> yeah it was but um so when you're in when you're in school are you uh -huh. thinking about rap rapping while you're in class no, nah, low key, I enjoy going to school. Really? Yeah, people find that weird, but like going. I did not make him say this. <laughs> I did not make him say going this. Going to class is actually kind of chill for me. So, like, really? I go to class, handle all of that. But then when I get back, of course, I'm focused on music and whatnot. But yeah, school is fun. I saw you just dropped another video. Yeah. From the Fits. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You want to talk about that a little bit? Yeah, the video is actually called Pound Fits. You know, I was up in Detroit. And I was chilling and I would just shot the video. I like the whole atmosphere we found for it. It's a little greenery area. We shot it in some backyards. So yeah, it's a pretty cool video. Most people was feeling it too. Definitely. Because it's, it's actually a video where I didn't produce. So one of my homies from back home, he produced the two freshmen. So yeah, people were surprised by a different sound for those who haven't heard the mixtape yet. So. Yeah. yeah, it's definitely that's definitely what's up, man. You know, saying uh -huh. back to people back home. Yeah, you know, um, the mini state that you do have like in the works. You know, you got any new people you you gonna put in that in that pot, or you just gonna keep it all homegrown? What you've been doing? Or, nah, you? I'm actually reaching out on it. So like the production, most of the production on the other mixtapes I did, but for this one, already the songs I have, I haven't produced anything. So it's trying to expand my sound on this next one. 
that's new for you. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> that's and as far as new. features, I'm gonna have some features on this one. Okay. I've been slacking on that. I feel like so. I mean, I'm gonna show some other people some love. Okay. Throw them on the mixtape. All right, that's cool, man. I saw because I, you know, I saw you was on a couple of different uh, people's songs yeah. on their their mixtape. Yeah. That's how I was like. You don't, you know, yeah. haven't seen you do the same thing on there. Definitely I know they're probably like, you know, when, it, when I'm going to get on a mixtape with B-Shows, uh -huh, you know? I'm definitely about to start reaching out to some cats for that. Hey, man, there's one thing I do got to ask you, though. What's that, guy? Anybody come on a press show, uh -huh. they got to spit. <laughs> they got to do a 16. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Y'all rappers, you got to rap. It was expected. It was expected, definitely. You ready, right? <laughs> yeah. Of course he's ready. He's yeah. August. That's so, it. So, I'm going to step back. You do your thing. Hi, right, yo. Hey, it's Kicks and LPs, and now I feel big. Bigger than 12-3. They always tell me I'm killing my own category. My pants sag, new shirt, some Air Jordans. Don't run into the wall trying to see what I got on. When I opened up my closet, she's surprised by what I own. And she heard I make beats, now she want to make a song. But I got to get dressed right before I mix it down. And the mirror says, shells, every day is a headline. They don't even rock with you, do you ahead of time? Yeah. Only option to stay ahead of mine. Trent said it made Kyle Records. It's my state of mind. I got 99. One more to go. Ironic, I'm selling clothes to make the money that I blow. I'm feeling like an icon everywhere I go. And I'm acting like every single second is a show. I'm cool. Shows <laughs> fresh. <laughs> That's crazy. Man. See, I told you. The boy's yeah. nice. I told you the boy's nice. Before you roll, man, you uh -huh. wanna shout out to anybody out there? Yeah, man, shout out to the whole Anthem culture. Everybody who out here rocking with me, shout out Shaq Smith, my homies and Corey, they roll out here, they chilling somewhere. Follow me on Twitter, make sure you do that. At B Shells, B S H E L S. We can chill, kick it, you know, we on there. Hey man, follow me on, on Twitter, A at VA for Pretz. Whole name, say the whole thing. <laughs> That's right, called Quest. <laughs> but also, man, follow my man ACM of Films, man. He's behind the camera, killing it, producing a lot of videos out here. Yeah. I need to check them out. Every week, we're coming from a different angle, different city, different place. The local artists be getting y'all here, promoting y'all a little bit, showing y'all some love. All right? This is the press show. Peace.